Uh, this painting is called Tizzy, and it, uh, its genesis was I was doing a life-size uh, figure drawing with some students in class, and uh, what happened was, while I was doing the painting, it really struck me as a, as a good pose to represent conflict. He's got his back to us, he's got his arms crossed. He's a, an archetypal mm -hmm. person in a lot of ways, you know, he's sort of nondescript, not even hair, so to speak. So I thought he was a sort of a pers perfect person to represent this conflict that I'm regularly in, you know, in tune with uh, about how we manage nature very poorly. And I, I don't know why, I can't even explain how it came into being, but I... I realized as I was doing the drawing that he needed uh, a almost, not a flock because they're all different types of birds but but a, a, a maelstrom I guess of birds around his head to help represent that and I didn't want him in the natural world I wanted him in this artificial sort of studio setting with this invasion of nature about his head sort of almost representing a, a sort of a, not only the conflict but the mental state mm -hmm. you know so that's where that one came from.